this is the brand new PCH which we are going to replace in this motherboard and today you will uh, come to know that uh, how we can change the IC. So before you have to use the BGA machine the glue you have to remove from the motherboard okay. So the all corner is persisted with the glue this is the company glue and which is very hard to remove. So what you have to take help of slightly heat from the hot air gun. And very gently you have to remove it because uh, the track could be broken. Now what you have to do, you have to use a paste, BGA paste. And don't try to remove it with the uh, hot air gun because uh, the motherboard PCB will pop up and there would be a, a bubble will come out and you would not be able to replace the new IC. Okay. So avoid to use hot air gun. Now let us come. I will demonstrate you on the BG machine. I will remove it. I will clean the track and I will replace the new IC. So this is the BG machine. Zumo BG machine. So this is the part number of my BG machine ZMR5830 and uh, the concept of uh, operating the BG machine we have discussed in previous video. If you haven't seen that video you just go and see that video in our channel and uh, all the procedure we have discussed over there ok. You can take advantage of that video. Now this is the operation and uh, all things are set here what I need to do only only I have to start it. There are the feature we can save 100, uh, 100 profile in the same uh, BG machine the different types of profile we can set but uh, in my BG machine uh, we usually use the same type of profile for each and every IC because we have experience that uh, the so many ICs we replace. We know that uh, when we have to remove the CPU and when we have to remove the uh, NVIDIA and when we have to remove the Intel chip. So Now you can see that the temperature has raised to 265 degrees Celsius and uh, as we have uh, told you in last video that uh, if the IC is lead free then the melting temperature start to begin to melt and it is start to melt from the 260 degrees Celsius. Now let us wait because there are the so many things you have to observe like thickness of the ICs and uh, the glue or also consider so there are the so many things you have to care about and it think I think that uh, it must be come out now let's wait slightly more least uh, the track will be come out Now you can see we have taken out the IC from the motherboard. Let us stop it and uh, this is the manual cooling, we just press it. <laughs> 